My name's Nick Chamberlain, I come from Moseley in Birmingham. Uh, my music's often influenced by the textures and techniques used in world folk and art music, especially African, Eastern European and Middle Eastern music. When writing for student performers, ideas are often generated via improvisation, either by myself in the initial stages or by the performers in rehearsals or a combination of both. For professional players, the structure and material are worked out more formally, often visually via drawings and diagrams, and then developed through time screens, harmonic schemes, etc., to create a rich, colourful, layered texture. My shortlisted piece is called Diaspora. It's a string trio for violin, viola and cello, and it's in a single movement. And this piece is intended to be a meditation and an elegy on the plight of the world's refugees. Uh, it often seems to me very strangely ironic that much of the world's most beautiful, complex folk music has evolved from extreme conflict and suffering. And rather than simply quote folk melodies, I've tried to invoke um, a spirit through the harmonies, cross rhythms and textures, as well as through mel melodic ornamentation, often associated with folk playing techniques. For example, quarter tone inflections, glissandi and other expressive devices. The piece I'm working on presently has the working title Origins of Belief. It's a 10-minute work for 14 instruments in a single movement and is inspired by David Lewis Williams' book The Mind in the Cave and Paul Devereux's Stone Age soundtracks. It describes the three-tier cosmos, the spirit worlds invoked by the altered mental states of Neolithic man at the dawn of human consciousness between 40 and 70,000 years ago. All art communicates and is a rep representation of human consciousness. It is the flowering of our imagination spirituality at that time that the piece celebrates. In the teaching of music and composition, I believe students should not only be introduced to styles and techniques, but also be encouraged to gain an understanding of the evolutionary role of music, its place in culture, its relationship to science, especially mathematics, and the physical nature and effects of sound on our mental states. Ultimately, as artists, teachers and learners, our aim is to um, evolve a striking individual style through an eclectic and holistic approach.